Okay, guys. Hello and welcome. Andrew is here, and uh, as I promised, I was going to share with you one of my favorite keyword tools. Okay, please uh, remember, I hate paid tools. I will not gonna show you any paid tools, and this is absolutely free video. I will not gonna uh, charge you or sell you anything here. So this is just one of my favorite ways of making keywords because I remember when I started how hard it was to make uh, keywords and by the way uh, I know that some of you have no clue at all how to make keywords properly that's why I'm helping you out right here I'm actually teaching this the same on my trainings but for those who are not in my trainings it will be hopefully aha moment at some point okay because this is very important this is the cause for your sales okay i really believe in a cause and effect law because i will share with you exactly the same cause which causes me quite a good money every month okay because i'm using this keyword tool here okay with that said let's go straight away here let's say i choose this um, item which is actually i like this very much you can sell this seven 99 group for uh, because this is 499 and you can get a lot of sales if you are selling uh, as I teach for 799 right so this is perfect now what we have to do is uh, we have to define what it is actually this is obviously not the chemical guys nothing to do with the chemical guys I don't know who the chemical guys are and I don't care about them because I know this is kind of like microfiber applicator okay and probably it's premium grade if it says premium grade it is so what i do i try to always define the main the the core of the i take sometimes the titles are very long ones but i try to pick up two three words uh, what which defines the product okay in this case it's premium grade microfiber applicator okay i take those uh, words and I go to Google I open a new page on a Google and I paste them in there all right when I paste them in there I come to, uh, something like this and there is a uh, images you see you got the images option there click on the images and you got all those keywords right here all right so then I open a new simple note because I have a Mac computer I open on a simple note my um, where I write the text and I start to just to paste them. This is premium grade microfiber applicator, all right? So uh, then I I go back and I see here, mm, and here is the guy, here is the deal, guys. If you want to make money, you have to think. That's it. You have to think. You if you will just follow, if you will just copy paste, you will not gonna make money. If you will gonna use those freaking weird tools out there and pay their mem membership monthly, you will not gonna make money. Oh no, well, it's wrong. You will gonna make money, but you will gonna make such amount of money that you are not happy. I'm not using any of that crap, and that's what I am showing you here how to make money with manual work. Okay, if you like manual work, watch me. If not, then I'm sorry, we are not in the same frequency. All right, so what I'm doing here is chemical guys, forget about this. I don't need them. Paint, hmm, probably it's for paint, all right? Guys, workforce, I don't know what does it mean. Wax applicators, yeah, I think so. It's wax applicators because I think it's, uh, let me see, let me see. Uh, applying wax sealants glazes dressings and conditioners yes it's it is it is i can go with the wax applicator so it's wax applicator let's go me let's go so microfiber applicator premium grade wax applicator uh, microfiber applicator so obviously obviously applicator pads applicator sponges microfiber wax pads okay wax applicator pads i think this looks like pads to me all right so it would be it would be pads all right microfiber applicator pads i think those are the keywords uh, do, 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 like this okay like this wax applicator pads okay wax applicator 
bucks uh, per page of expertise. Uh, please pay box applicator pads all right boxer so guys now i have to show you something really important because uh you have to add you have to add hyphens here all right and this is critical this is important you have to add hyphens between the words everywhere if you leave the space you're done because it will be read only like this you have to connect them with the hyphens why because we used hyphens to join words to indicate that they have combined meaning okay wax applicator pads it's combined meaning we we create that meaning by putting hyphens in between here if there is no hyphens like this if you were gonna live like this okay this is uh, the algorithm the google algorithm will not gonna read it not google algorithm not ebay algorithm they will just uh, read separate words but if you put hyphens between they will gonna read meaning okay but don't put the hyphens in your title let's say this is your title well actually what i'm doing is i use always my my uh, my main keywords but we will come to that uh, in the beginning of the title but okay this is about the keywords this is not about the titles okay so what else i got here remember okay hyphens between between words okay and this is exactly how you have to put them and uh, connect them with the pictures with the hyphens connect them to the pictures all right so because i'm i know some of you are thinking well what's it's so basic i know guys this is so basic but believe me I'm working with hundreds and hundreds of students and majority does not know this. Majority makes mistakes right here with those hyphens. All right, okay? And then they wonder why they don't have sales. This is the critical, this is stumbling block, okay? So this is simple, but I said there is no secret, there is no magic, there is just how to make your settings properly. This is how you have to do it properly, all right? So let's continue. Wax applicator pads. Yeah. Sponges clothes. No, it's kind of like no applicator pads. I got applicator pads already. Applicator sponges. No, microfiber wax. Mi microfiber wax. Yeah. 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 Microfiber wax. Microfiber. Let's do like this. Microfiber. Microfiber wax applicator pads okay and then i go and i will keep this one here i just bear with me a second i will explain you something important here again you see what i'm doing is actually i will gonna make some few i i i choose in my mind the main meaning of the product the main meaning is uh, obviously not the premium grade that's why i'm not uh repeating this meaning here in a word but i keep repeating and playing around the applicator pads or or microfiber applicator pads okay this is kind of like the main meaning microfiber applicator pads and i trying to make my keywords around this main meaning microfiber wax applicator pads wax applicator pads okay you hear me i hope you hear me okay so when I run out of the ideas here, what I can do is I can just click on them. One thing, I can click on them and I see another like uh, what is coming up here. And look here, polishing. Why not? I really believe it's for polishing as well. So I go back here and what I'm doing is I'm adding poly, polishing, polishing microfiber applicator pads all right polishing microfiber applicator pads all right what else car care mm, why not i think that that's a good one car care microfiber applicator pads all right car care microfiber applicator pads all right so what else actually how much we got six uh okay let's make some more Chimical guys, no sponges, applicator, microfiber, 
foam, polishing blue, float, microfibre, applicator, sponges, sponges, uh, what else? No, no more. Okay, that's enough. That's good enough. You see, I got some nice keywords here. What else I'm doing in the same time, what else I'm doing is I go back to my item here, and this is what I'm doing. I go to the folks description. I don't uh, use so much description. Sometimes I use description also, but I like customer questions and answers because, you know, customer questions are the ones which can give you the best keywords out there because this is the language how people speak. Is that the language? That's why it's really important for me to go to look here because. This is, a, as a, my language is not the English, my mother's language, okay? So it's really helpful for specifically for international folks or for those folks whose English is not first language. You're just picking out some how people like, let's say you're working in a car shop, okay? And you are the car mechanic or whatever. You are working with the bodies, uh, with the car bodies. So this is the language how you speak, all right? You see, the micro, micro pad, can be the micro pad can be reused and washed all right so I got right here I got the micro pad okay this is the language how the people they define this stuff micro pad automatically I go back here and I put micro fiber now but uh, micro uh, what it was micro pad micro applicator pads okay because this guy i believe he knows what he's talking about reused and washed washable reusable washable you see where you get the and you can go on and on just taking out uh, the important words from here because the guys they are care about if the question is can i reuse can, can can those be reused can i use them again can i wash them okay and uh, probably, most probably, some of the folks, well, I believe, and this is what I'm, I have been experienced, that if I use, I can put here washable even, washable, okay, washable microfiber applicator pads, okay, and again, applicator pads, applicator pads, applicator pads, applicator pads, and I have all sorts of applicator pads. I'm playing everything around my applicator pads by using, by using, uh, customer reviews here, customer questions, and you can go on and on. Sometimes read reviews that mention wax applicator pads, applying, wash, apply, washing, washing, sponge, foam apart, washed sponges. You can get interior. Yeah, why not? It's for interior. For the leather, yes. And you can, uh, you can just put those meaningful words into your, and uh, play with them around your applicator pads, okay? Interior applicator pads, washing applicator pads, washable, reusable, and so on and so on. Okay, and then you make from your keywords, you make title. All right, you choose your main keywords, put right here, and you just go on and nicely add those keywords to your title. Guys, this is the way how I use, this is my, one, of, one of my ways which causes me great results. And I'm satisfied with the results because I'm so happy that there is such a great tool out there for free. You can use it for free, all right? You can use this for free here, and you can use the Google's suggested keywords for free, all right? Guys, this was really simple, but sometimes simple things make and very basic things make the biggest changes in your sellings uh, this is just from my experience because i really believe you don't need any of the paid tools any if i say any i mean any because i am not using any paid tool not at one all right guys i hope this was uh, useful for you and enjoy your keyword creating tools for free and make a cause for great results. All right. Have a nice day and see you on the next videos. Bye-bye for now.